We should vote Kuzak. The Mills guy's just another suit. He knows nothing about ordinary people. Go back to your room, sweetheart. It's just someone on the staircase. So OCP is ordering you to break into the apartment of a reporter they don't like? Any comment before I write a story on that? I am here to investigate domestic terrorism. OCP sent you to my safe house because they want to know what I have on them after the bank incident. I assume there is more if you cannot store everything here. I found a rental bill for a locker in a storage facility. Make up your mind. First you let me go at the bank, and now, when I'm actually starting to figure out what the OCP scam is all about, you show up and ruin this. Do you want to help OCP avoid liability? Your evidence is invalid if you obtained it illegally. I don't collect it for the court. I won't win against OCP there. It turns out I was right. That thing that OCP plans to do with charging residents of old Detroit with additional costs? It is a loophole. It will lead to the illegal expulsion of thousands of people if you help OCP silence me. Explain. Not so fast. I need to be able to trust you first. At the bank, you've proved that you are more than just a tool programmed to obey OCP, but now the stakes are higher. What is it that you expect? Since you're here, I fully expect someone from OCP to go and check my locker. I need to protect what's inside, but there's a meeting I need to keep an eye on. Too much depends on it. I will not be involved in the smuggling of contraband. There's nothing illegal about my request. I need only one box from there. The one with the inscription, Bakery on the Corner. The rest you can leave to OCP to pick up. I need to just spring clean my out-of-date documents anyway. Call me once you secure the box. Woo! <laughs> 
Smoking is dangerous, not to mention illegal. I don't give a shit about either. Then you must suffer the consequences. Eh, no one in this country values independent thinkers anymore. Like me? Are you a true environmentalist? Do you appreciate the majestic beauty of nature? And do you feel helpless knowing that every year more and more species are becoming extinct? Because let's face it, there's nothing that can be done. So, you know what they say. If you can't beat them, join them. Last Chance Safari. See all the endangered species before it's too late. Last Chance Safari is the largest collection of near extinct species. Man, it's RoboCop. So what? We're just sitting here enjoying the moment. Nothing suspicious. Right, officer? Shouldn't we give the fellas the signal? We should just shut up and smile like the exemplary citizens that we are. Are you lost, officer? I can show you the exit if you want. Trouble with the lock. Uh, seems that I forgot the key, but, uh... You will tell your story at the station. Are you sure you have enough seats in your car to take us all? If you do not come quietly, I will not need any. This is our...
Well, well, well. Looks like Mr. Becker was right. You're up to something behind his back. These things are supposed to go to Mr. Becker, I reckon. What will interest Becker is in locker number 17. The contents of this box are none of OCP's concern. I'll have to tell Mr. Becker that you have not given us all the material. I assure you that it will end up worse for you than for me. Late. Sorry, I had to take a bus. Freaking OCP robots destroyed my car during that bank robbery. So I'm guessing you have my stuff. Did OCP arrive at the party? They tracked my location. Because they trust you so much. Speaking of which, the box. What if I lied about it? Did you ever think of that? There may be a bomb inside, or the head of my sworn enemy. Do you want to know what's inside? No. The sound of your voice does not indicate that you are lying. Just don't depend on your lie detector when you talk to politicians. In the box are my personal belongings. Letters, memorabilia, things that actually matter to me. When you become too tough to hit directly, the scum will try to get to you through your loved ones. I understand. So we have even more in common. Once OCP takes care of my old documents, I'll have the space to deal with the Delta City issue and help the people of old Detroit. You've helped them already, though. Thank you. Ronnie's Grocery. Leave the box there. What do you mean, a dollar? It's twenty-three fifty. I have Samantha's belongings. Ah, uh, yes. I'm glad you're helping her. Without that girl, OCP would put us all on the street. Still might. They did a number on a lot of families. Hers included. Samantha's mother took it worst. But that's not a story for me to tell. Anyway, uh, leave the box in the back, next to the cat food. She's supposed to pick up everything tomorrow.
Hey you, the old man is waiting for you upstairs. This entrance to the building is off limits. You have to use the staircase. Do you think it's gonna hold his weight? Doesn't matter. This don't count. The old man's waiting. So, it's true what they say. You do have some kind of defect. Oh, it's good to see you, my boy. Leave us. I want to talk to him in private. You have to excuse me for not getting up. I'm in a rather unfortunate state. You did exceptional work at the bank. I want you to know that I am deeply grateful for your service to OCP and the city of Detroit. See, I grew up in this very apartment. Or what's left of it. It used to be a thriving neighborhood. Nothing like what you see right now. I always dreamt of turning it into the most prosperous district in the city. A new heart of Detroit. Can you imagine? Or do you think it's just an old fool's pipe dream? I agree with all city improvement plans that have the citizens' well-being in mind. Glad to know you approve. Delta City's construction is about to start. Finally, the old and frail will be replaced with the new and strong. Decay and death are terrible things. You lose everything you worked for your entire life. But I don't have to tell you what that's like. It really makes me wonder has the time you spent in that armor been a burden to you? The only burden it causes is to criminal scum. I admire your confidence. The real reason I've summoned you here is because I'm worried. I'm aware of your instability problems. And it's not a matter that we can overlook. That's why I've requested to have people look after you. Tell me, how are you finding your evaluations with Dr. Blanche? I am happy to comply with any activity that improves effectiveness. You're a good sport. I can imagine it's not a pleasant experience, but I can't express how much I'd like you to keep at it. I'm sure that becoming a liability is the last thing you'd want. Am I right? That is correct. Now we've reached an understanding. Tell me, is there anything I could do to put your mind at ease? My partner has been severely wounded and is being treated at Gibson Memorial Hospital. I'll make sure she gets the best care there is. Thank you. I have to say, you brought a lot of hope into this old man's heart. Now, excuse me. I'm not supposed to exert myself too much. <laughs> Doctor's orders. And you can't argue with them. Take care of yourself. After all, the peace of Detroit depends on your well-being. Oh. Holy shit! What was that? Robocop. Not such a piece of junk after all.
Are you done with the old man's tea party? Remember to get back in touch with your informer. See if he has any info that can get us back on the biker's lead. Spike is still out there. OCP wants to raise towers of glass and steel? Eh, go ahead! Just not where we live. my FTO anywhere. Could I have his name, please? Over. Sure thing. It's Officer Rat. He should be in one of the dumpsters. That's the only place he belongs, if you catch my drift. Over and out. Right. So much for my field training. Officer Washington, I will be your field trainer for today. Requesting readiness confirmation. Yeah, thanks for the offer, but maybe the others are right. I might not really be cut out for field work. If we live the way others want us to live, what kind of life would it be? Or rather, whose? You're right. I want to be my own man. Officer Washington reporting for field training. Good, you have your body armor on. Well done. What about the rest of your gear? Service pistol? Got it. Spare ammunition? Check. Duty light? Never part with it. Good job. Preparation is the most important. So is knowing your surroundings. Are you familiar with this area? Isn't this the part of the city where it gets really busy like all the time? Please! I think that answers my question. Please! I need your help! Set the radio to my channel and follow me. Roger that! An officer needs to be confident. Straight back, sturdy walk, together with a clear and unshaking voice. Officers! Thank God you're here. I really need your help. What happened is... When responding to a request for aid, the first thing is to introduce yourself to the potential victim. Watch and learn. I am Officer Murphy. How do you do, madam? Well, to tell you the truth... The second thing is to reassure the victim of their safety. Madam, you do not need to be afraid anymore. We are here to help you. Yes, but it's not about me. The third thing is... I'm quite familiar with the field training manual, so if you don't mind, I'll take over. Ma'am, could you please tell us what happened? It's my cat, Fortune. He's missing. Fortune is my biggest treasure. I can't lose him. Do you have any idea where he might be? The only place I can think of is the basement. I've also heard some ruckus coming from downstairs today, but the lights aren't working and my eyesight's not so good anymore. Is it okay for us to investigate the basement? Yes, it makes an excellent opportunity for low light training. Let us proceed downstairs. Good luck down there. The cat has that name for a reason. He really brings fortune. Turn Don't your you flashlight come back without on. Him. Right. Duty light can be advantageous, but it can also be a liability. Keeping it close to you creates a clear target for the violators. It is good practice to hold the duty light away from your body. I don't remember reading that in the field manual. Did you get it from a different book? No, from experience.
clear. Clear. Hey, I think I just saw the cat. You think I should try to remove these planks? Go ahead. Wow! I didn't know I had so much strength in me. You will never know until you try. What was that? Ah oh, man, I walked into a mess. And now my shoes are covered in strawberry jam. When chasing a suspect, do not rush head first. Take blind corners as wide as possible. Cuts down on being surprised. Fugitive has left a trail. This time, pace yourself. Do not get out of breath during a foot pursuit. You will need stamina to engage the fugitive later. Oh, looks like he stopped by the spill paint can. Suspect might be intoxicated. I used to know these kids who gave their cat stomach medicine to make it loopy. Is there a moral to that story? Cats are susceptible to substance misuse. Shh! I heard something. I think it's coming from the piano. That cat must be hiding inside. Let me lure it out. Go ahead. There it is! It's escaping! Darn it! It went through here, but that's a very narrow passage. Let's try the door. It's locked, but I can try to squeeze through that gap. Go ahead. Okay, here I go. It's actually not as bad as I thought. Cool. Now, let me get that door open for you. Who'd have thunk that being small can actually have its advantages? An eager police. What was that? I'm afraid this time it's a one-way street, Mr. Cat. But where are you hiding? There he is. Oh, gosh, Fortune. You look a mess. You think he's all right? The cat is fine. You can take it back to its owner. I will clean up any remaining mess. Okay, see you soon.
Washington. Do you read me? Loud and clear. What is your status? We got a problem. I'm on the second floor and have a visual on multiple armed suspects entering our location. Most of them are heading your way, but I can hear some coming up the stairs. Do not engage yet. Take your time and find the most advantageous Normal location. Is here. Got it. Officer Washington? Sir. Keep cool. I am coming to have your back. Glad to hear that, sir. Longer, sir. We're in pig. Nowhere to hide now. Ah! What is your status? I'm here. Remain calm. I am here. That was tense. I need a breather. Officer Washington, your performance today was impressive. Thank you, sir. Means a lot coming from you. You will be fine. It is only a superficial wound. See? I've told you that cat brings luck. Isn't this just wonderful?